is Coin Toss presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Carter has the ball set how he wants it. And we're just about ready to kick this game off, folks. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. Tries to get around the corner. And he carries the ball for a nice game. From their own 31-yard line. Second down. Tackle made at about the 39-yard line. You talk about a dual-threat guy, this guy can hurt you in the air or on the ground. They get nice yardage on that run. Six yards. That'll make it second and four. Right. From their own 45-yard line. Second down. He's tackled around the 46-yard line. Gain of one yard. Third down. Stop behind the line. He had nowhere to go on that option play. Boy, he's right. He's lucky he held onto the football there. Lindsay back deep to return. From the 15, tackle at the 27 yard line. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Pitches in and he's got a lead. Makes it out to about the 39. The reason why it's so crucial to be able to run effectively like this is it keeps the defense guessing. They have no idea whether you're passing or running, even if you need medium to long range yards. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 39. He's taken down at about the 35. That makes it second and 14. Pitches back. Good outside run there. A four-yard gain by the halfback on the option. Third and ten coming up. Ball on the 39-yard line. And down he goes around the 47-yard line. Wow, a long gain, but still not enough for the first. Well, the offense hurt themselves by digging themselves into a hole on first and second down, so the defense didn't really have to put too much thought in how to defend on that third down. He gets hit out of bounds right around the 24-yard line. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. but he's going to lose yards here. Loss of two yards on the play. That'll bring up second and 11. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on their own 22. Pitches, and he's got room. And they push him out at the 36. You like to see a team having success like this running the football. It can really open up things for the offense. And a 
Kirilov up the middle and he's stuck. No gain on the play. That makes it second and ten. Right. From their own 36 yard line. Second down. Right around the 50. It's a nice job here by the wide receiver of looking the ball in and keeping the chains moving. He was on the same page as his quarterback as they both saw the double outside linebacker blitz coming. Around the 48 yard line. That's a loss of two yards on the play. That'll bring up second and 12. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on the 48. Hey, check Mike 21. Mike 21. Check Mike 21. You can't block me. Hey. Down. You can't hey. Now he tries to buy some time. And he hits him hard at the 47. to about the 47 yard line the line no gain on the play that brings us fourth and seven the punter is going to try to pin them deep in their own territory with a good punt here this one will go into the end zone and they'll bring it out to the 20. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. Tackle at the 32. Gain of 12 yards. That makes it first and 10. It's first and 10. Ball on the 32-yard line. Got some open field. Makes it to the 47. Call it a gain of 15 yards. First down. From their own 47 yard line, it's first down. Pitches it, and he's taken down at midfield. McCaffrey gets the speed option and takes it for about a three-yard gain. When you've got the experience that this safety has, you can read plays very quickly and be in just the right position to make a stop near the line of scrimmage. He tackles him for a loss. Now it's third and nine coming up. Ball on their own 49. And they make the stop, the 39-yard line. Williams brings him down with the 39-yard line. Well, Kirk, good news. We saw him go to the locker room a little bit earlier with that injury, but apparently he's all right. It looks like he's going to get back in the action here. They'll bring him down around the 39-yard line. Second and ten. From the 39 yard line, it's second down. He's going left. Makes the grab and steps out right away. 20 yards. That makes it first and ten. This is the eighth play of this drive. Makes it out to about the 10. Call it a gain of nine yards. That brings up second and one. It's second down now. They're just a few feet away from that first down marker. 
Well, after that injury, we'll get to see the backup quarterback here. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Call it a gain of seven yards. And this is the tenth play of the drive. Kirk, we saw this guy head to the locker room a little bit earlier. Good to see him back on the sideline, and it looks like he could be returning to the game. Goes for the touchdown, and it's going to be an interception. Offside, defense. Still first down. First and goal from the one, looking to punch this one in. They'll drop him for a loss. Played one. Still no score. And we welcome you back to the action here, and we have got a tight one going on in quarter number two. Trying to take the lead by a field goal. Kicks away, and he's got it. is lined up to kick this one off. Number 29 needs to return. It's fielded at the two. And he's hammered down. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. That makes it second and six. It's second down, six to go. Ball on the 26. He's to the 40. He's at midfield. And they finally knock him out at the 45. So they pick up big yards on the option keeper. I thought he's going to break that one for a touchdown. You couldn't draw that up any better. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 45-yard line. They'll get him for a loss. You keep gaining negative yards, and you put yourself in a position of having to make bigger and bigger plays. Puts a lot of pressure on that quarterback. is tough as nails. Brad, he's going to sit in that pocket and give himself a chance. The only problem is, at some point, you've got to have a feel. Almost that sixth sense on when to get out of there and avoid the pressure, or just to throw the ball before you get hit. Quick out to his receiver. He's at the 30 to the 20. He's tackled at the 16-yard line. It's 
first and ten after the big pass play. Level at the six. That'll make it second in inches. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. And he's got the touchdown. Fullback to put six on the board. When you give this kid a chance, he can get it done. That was a nice looking run. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A seven play, 79 yard drive, and they come away with seven points. So our score, 7 3, and it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He'll take it from the two. He makes it to the 25-yard line. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Makes it out to about the 36. That's good for a game of 11 yards. That makes it first and 10. First and 10. Ball on the 36-yard line. Tackle outside after a nice pickup. That's a gain of six on the play. That'll make it second and four. Fights forward to about the 43. That makes it third and three. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. He laterals. He's pushed out of bounds at the 44 yard line. Call it a gain of 13 yards. First down. Some open field. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. A game of five on the play. That'll make it second and four. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Nice run there. This is the kind of steady, strong drive that coaches love to see. Right now, they're firing on all cylinders. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. That's a gain of three on the play. That makes it second and six. And this play is number eight on the drive. Well, as they take a look at that injury on the sideline, let's see what this backup can do at quarterback. The defense got a great push and blew that play up well behind the line of scrimmage. Third down, and they need to get it to the 23. Well, Kirk, we saw this kid head to the locker room a little bit earlier with that injury, and now we see these back on the sideline. That's good news. Looks like he should be able to get back in the action. Throws, and that one's going to hit the ground incomplete. These guys just don't seem to be on the same page, and they're going to have to be if they expect to win this game. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and he splits the uprights. Carter has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. 
You know, the last time we saw this offense on the field, they drove the length of the field. And you think back to what that defensive coordinator tried to do. He tried to change some things up, but nothing seemed to work. It's going to be interesting to see how he can have an impact on this drive. They'll knock him down for a loss. That brings up second and 13. From their own 22-yard line, second down. And he's immediately tackled. And on the throw, he caught it. to bring on the punt team. Great hold by the defense. They were expecting the pass play and they defended it very well. Russell awaits the snap. He makes it to the 42-yard line. Every single time this offense has the ball, they're moving the football, but they're settling for field goals. And every time they settle for field goals, I've been watching the defense that they've been facing and watching how they run off the field to celebrate a job well done because they're not giving up touchdowns. That's a bad sign. He's taken down at the 42-yard line. It's second and ten. Second down and ten to go. Ball on the 42. And down he goes around the 46-yard line. They pick up a few yards there on the pass. And I'll tell you what, that fake handoff froze the secondary just enough to allow for the receiver to come up with a nice gain that time. Good call. Bring him down behind the line. That was a loss of one yard. That'll bring up second and 11. From the 47 yard line, second down. Goodson gains around two yards there on the option. That brings up third and 10. yard line the smart quarterbacks and offensive linemen have a really unique relationship a quarterback should take care of his offensive linemen but after that play and that hit you really got to be wondering what kind of relationship this quarterback and his offensive linemen have after that the punt upcoming and they're going to come after this one Excellent punt. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. Both offenses have played it pretty close to the best so far in this one. Yeah, because they've been so conservative, it's made it pretty easy for both of these defenses to be pretty dominant. Let's see an offense open it up and take a few chances. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. to 31. We've got a first and 10. Ball on their own 31. Completes it, but he can't shake the defense. They pick up a good six yards there. You get six yards, and that makes picking up the first down very reasonable. Tackled at the 41. The Bulldogs are going to call their second timeout. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 41 yard line. Blue 
Briscoe at the 50. Check, check. Texas. That brings up second and one. Texas. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. LeBlanc was the intended receiver on the play. That'll make it third and one. He fights forward to around midfield. No game. That'll bring up fourth and one. Lindsay is back deep to return. Punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. Points were very hard to come by in those first two quarters. They'll head to the locker room. 7-6, Bulldogs. We played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Maybe the most important statistic from the first half, no turnovers for either team. So far, a good job of ball security, but now you wonder if the quarterbacks can avoid putting the ball in jeopardy. They're going to want to make a big play, and that might sort of set off a feeding frenzy on the defensive side. Yeah, and it's in defenses, that's the number one priority. I mean, you can give up a lot of yards. You could, they can chew up yards up and down the field, but if you can force turnovers, then you're keeping them off the scoreboard, and, and that's your number one goal. So I, defenses, they, they have to be a little bit upset right now, and they got to try to find ways to, to hit harder. How about when you're tackling? Use this strip stick. You know, be able to strip the ball out, get the ball out, try to get some interceptions, try to make some user picks, you know, do whatever you can to try to get the football back from that offense and set your offense up in good field position. I can only hope that Nestler and Herb Street will bring the same type of intensity to their call of the second half that David and I have brought to the halftime show. Of course, they always do. That's it for us here in the studio. Time to get you back out to the guys for the second half. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. Nice kick, plenty of distance. From his own goal line, he's to the 20. And he makes it out to about the 21-yard line. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. And they get nice yardage on that run. Gain of six yards. That brings up second and five. It's second and five here. Ball on the 27. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Gain of four on the play. That'll bring up third and inches. He's to the 40. He's at midfield. Oh, so close to breaking it. Call it again, 35 yards. That makes it first and 10. First down and 10 to go after the big gain on the run. He's at the 20. They'll bring him down at the 13. In 21 yards. First down. Tackles him hard at the 10. Game of 
three on the play. That'll make it second and seven. Second down and seven. Ball on the 10 yard line. Nice run, and he's brought down. Call it a gain of five yards. That'll bring up third and two. Double tight, double tight. Come down, come down. Right game, right game. Damn. Back and down. Three, back and down. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Loss of two on the play. That brings up fourth and three. This should be an easy field goal. And he can put his team in the lead right here with this field goal. He gets it up, and they tack on three points. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Jackson need to return. He'll return it from the one. And down he goes at the 28-yard line. Well, this is a competitive game. It's fun to watch these two teams go back and forth. Just when you think one team has the edge, the other gets right back into it. This is exciting. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Tackle made around the 29-yard line. That's a gain of one on the play. That brings up second and nine. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 29-yard line. And he's sacked. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush because sacks can be real drive killers. the stop right around the 30. Number 27 makes the tackle at the 30-yard line. Fourth down. Russell is the punter. He's to the 40. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. The offense ready to go again. And their last drive ended with three points. And he makes it out to about the 44-yard line. That brings up second and nine. Comes in second down and nine to go. Ball on the 44. Backup quarterback into the game now to call the signals. Throws it in a hurry. And he's tackled right away. Call it a gain of eight yards. Third down. Kirk, we saw this guy head to the locker room a little bit earlier. Good to see him back on the sideline, and it looks like he could be returning to the game. Runs it left for a decent game. That's good for a gain of four yards. First down. First and ten. Ball on the 44-yard line. Taken down at about the 41. That's good for a gain of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. Right, right, Roger, Roger. Two down, two down. He gets hit out of bounds at the 33. Gain of eight on the play. That makes it first and ten. From the 33 yard line. First down. Nice run up the middle. Call it a gain of six yards. That'll make it second and four. He's tackled around the 19-yard line. Gain of eight yards. First down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 19. Oh, that 
a decent pickup. Game seven on the play. That'll bring up second and three. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. Pretty good defense there on the option. They'll stop him for a loss of one. That'll bring up third and four. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. Now he tries to buy some time. A huge play, and now they're in a great position to score. That makes and this is the 11th play of the current drive. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That brings up second and goal. It's second and goal. Ball on the one. Defense tacked in tight here. They'll get him for a loss. You know, a lot of times, coaches look to linebackers for leadership on defense. And on that tackle, he showed you why that's the case. Play 13 of the current drive. They'll drop him for a loss. It's fourth down. They'll line up for the field goal, and this is nothing more than a chip shot. Somebody jumped early down there. False start, offense. Sometimes what happens on a false start is a lineman will see Still movement on the down. other side of the ball and be coaxed into jumping early. Kicks up, and it sails through the uprights. Let's go. Carter has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. Makes it out to maybe the 19-yard line. You know, this defense played so well in the first half. I was very impressed. I know that, and I couldn't be more impressed with how they've carried it over to the third quarter. Well, the most impressive thing is the way they've been able to maintain that into this second half. They played lights out in the first half, but they just seem to be getting better as this game goes on. That's a great tackle at the 17. Loss of two yards on the play. That'll bring up second and 12. Second down and 12. Hey, Ball on the 17. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. it out. He's taken down around the 31-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 31. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. So the old counter gets two, maybe three yards. That makes it second and six. Pitch out, got the corner, and he makes it out to about the 37-yard line. Call it a gain of three yards. That makes it third and three. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. We head to the final quarter, and we've got a great game on our hands. 12. Seven.
Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Hey, check Mike 21, Mike 21, check Mike 21. Down. Up and up. They go to the left for a nice game. From their own 44-yard line, first down. And down he goes at about the 47-yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. 18, look at 18. Let's set a tone, fellas. Let's set a tone. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. From the 43-yard line, it's first down. Pitches out and the ball is up for grabs. The offense falls on it. This is the 10th play of this drive. And a quick throw. Brought down at the 48-yard line. So far this drive, the defense has been unable to stop them on third down. Fires that quickly, incomplete. I mean, he has his wide receiver wide open. You spend all those hours during the week to be able to get prepped and ready to go. You got an open man like this, just step and deliver and make the throw. Lindsey back deep to return. Brought down at the 16. A score here might effectively end this one. He makes it to the 18-yard line. That's a gain of two on the play. That makes it second and eight. From their own 18-yard line, it's second down. Scrambling around, and they bring him down for a sack on the play. That was a loss of three yards. That was a third and ten. Okay, just like that. Just like that. Grabs it and hammered right there. Gain of two yards. That'll bring up fourth and nine. Carter to punt. He's taken down at the 41 yard line. Return for a gain of 16 yards. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. They'll lose a yard on that quarterback keeper. One yard on the play. That makes it second and ten. It's second and ten. Ball on the 42. Makes the catch, and he's got nowhere to go. Nothing going on that play. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws it. Incomplete. And that wasn't the greatest pass in the world. Well, I don't know how anybody can throw a great pass while getting drilled like that. He'll try to change the field position and especially not get it to the end zone. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. 
Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. And he's tackled at the 33-yard line. Call it a gain of 13 yards. From their own 33-yard line. First down. Nice run to the outside. Gain of four on the play. That makes it second and six. Watch 14, watch 14. If you don't get this boy, you think you're going to get this. He makes his way to about the 48. Gain of 11 yards. That makes it first from their own 48 yard line. First down. He's at the 40. Knocked out of bounds around the 33 yard line. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on the 35 yard line. Complete brought down, nothing doing. Here comes the pressure. They'll make the sack. And how about the athleticism of that defensive end? Great sack right there. Great pressure there from the defensive line. They couldn't double team this guy because of the blitz, and he just got to the quarterback with his speed. After the sack, it's now fourth and long. This punt, if he gets it where he wants, it can really change the field position in this football game. into the end zone, down for a touchback. Well, these defensive coaches have got to be loving what they've seen from their guys today. Well, you and I talked to both of these coordinators getting ready for this game, and they put together a game plan. They shared it with us, and we're seeing it out there on the field today. They still are going to determine the outcome of this game. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Play fake and looking to run. Decides to slide. Bring him down around the 32-yard line. He's pushed out of bounds at about the 35. From their own 35-yard line. Second down. Quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. And that one probably should have been picked off. Yeah, are you kidding me? There's a blanket around that receiver. Somebody else had to be open. Yeah, 
Just a tremendous job by that defense, and their coordinator did a super job there to keep it this close in this ball game. And now the offense has got a chance to win it. So it's fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. He's under some heat. Well, that one should do it. A fourth down stop here late in the fourth quarter, and that should be the nail in the coffin in this game. When the first down marker is that far away, someone's got to step up and make a play on fourth down. It just didn't happen for him here. Nine times out of ten, the defense will make a stop on that play, but, you know, based on the situation, this offense did have to go for it. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. The Bulldogs taking their first time out of the half. From the 24-yard line, it's second down. A little over a minute in the game. And they get nice yardage on that run. The Bulldogs use their second timeout. He makes it out to maybe the 16-yard line. The Bulldogs using their third and final timeout. He gets out to about the 15-yard line. Third down, eight yards to go. Ball on the 15-yard line. The 10. Tackle around the three-yard line. That's a gain of 12 on the play. That makes it first and goal. So this one's in the books, and we saw a great one here today. The Terriers, 12. The Bulldogs, 7. So that wraps things up for us. 3A Sports and Kirk Kirk Street. I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.